today, Wednesday, March 3rd, 2021, the Ezra Long Laboratory would like to report that the backlog which was experienced during the months of January and February of 2021 has been completely cleared up and we have reverted now to our 24-hour turnaround time for COVID-19 PCR testing. The Ezra Long Laboratory has finalized the processes to increase the testing capacity over the last few months. During this period of February 25th through 28, 2021, we were able to do 2,408 patient samples during just a three-day period. To put this into context, in the month of August we were, last year, we were able to do 2,500 patient samples. One month's work in one week. And this was what the lab was faced with during those two months. What we were able to do we had to look at every single facet of our processes and try to see ways we can improve, be more efficient, and handle the increased workload. By this, we were able to bring in a biomedical engineer for repair and certification of a second biosafety cabinet, thus re developing redundancy. So if anything happens to it, we have a second to work with, which occurred on February 1st, 2021. We also procured an automated extraction robot which can do extractions of 188 patient samples in an 80 minute period. Um, putting it into context, manual extraction which was what we were doing would have a human being would be able to do 16 samples within an hour to two hour period. So this greatly increases our ability to test patient samples during the day. We had to get clerical staff in increasing the clerical staff from three to six persons and doing a 24-hour period workflow rather than the 16-hour workflow that was happening prior. Um, we had to get workstations for those persons to work. Computers, um, lab information systems inputted on them so we can be able to process and input the patient data and turn these results out from a sample into a result as soon as possible. Um, the laboratory is able to process between 762 to 1,125 samples daily with a 24-hour turnaround. Um, we continue to try to see how we can develop strategies that can minimize the risk of this backlog recurring and are still in discussion to improve our throughput even further to probably 2,000 to 2,500 in a day. The Ministry of Health and Wellness would like to thank the general public, each and everyone, for their patience during the laboratory results delay over the last few months. We acknowledge the impacts that, that this has had in the public service, the private sector, and in every single household. We continue to support the national effort in the management of the COVID-19 the Ministry of Health reminds the public that they must remain in isolation after testing and while symptomatic. Also, every single citizen is encouraged to continue adhering to the infection prevention and control measures to reduce the transmission of COVID-19 to friends and family. This includes the use of face masks, maintaining physical distance from others, and frequent hand washing.